All right, so I got to replace this faucet. And in order to replace this faucet, what I'm going to have to do is get right inside this little uh, that little hole. Okay, I'm five two. I weigh 164, so squeezing in there is going to be real tough. So ultimately, what I'm going to have to do, you see those two hoses right there? I'm going to squeeze in there, and then I am going to reach inside. Let me see. I'm going to have to reach inside, go through there and unscrew those two hoses okay so let me go in there and let's see i'll show you how i'm gonna crawl in there <clears throat> i'm gonna have to put my back right here so i want to put this towel so this doesn't hurt my shoulder blades too much so let me get in here <clears throat> So I'm going to have to probably put my hand here, go in here, ouch. Now I don't know if you can see this, but I got two hoses that I disconnected. I gotta get out of here. Okay, now I should be able to pull this. Now I should be able to pull that thing right out of there. Let's see. There you go. So my wife done a good job about cleaning around it. This, this is a uh, three, four year old. And so she cleans real good. As you can see, my wife's a real clean person. Now we're gonna have to replace this. Okay, she's on, she's on her way to Home Depot. So she'll, she should be here pretty soon. So this is the faucet she brought me. So now I have to convert um, this into this okay so i gotta remove this thing right here hopefully this fits inside there and let's see if it works all right so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna get underneath here and i'm gonna see if this thing will pop out of there okay Okay, now, let me see, I can grab this, or maybe, oh, yeah, what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut it, because uh, it is, I, I don't want to ruin this part, so let me get uh, a blade. So all I'm going to do is grab this knife and cut around this thing. Okay, so now the first thing I'm going to have to do is put the spacer, this thing here. So this is what's going to hold the pressure down. I'm, then underneath there, I'm going to have to put some screws. So I'm going to have to reach in there underneath 
Uh, there's a gasket right here that's going to keep the water from going inside. So this is going to go inside like this. And let's see if this hose, uh, not the hoses, but let's see if this will fit in there. And it will. Okay, so, but, um, we will have to put this thing in here too but first let me go in there and uh, tighten underneath there so what you're gonna do is you're gonna have this parts okay this is what's gonna secure that thing we also have to put this right here on top of this and then then we'll we'll go ahead and put this in there and from the bottom i'm going to put a, uh this guy right here he's going to go underneath here i'm going to tighten it up and it has some screws here so that it tightens it up also okay and this should keep it from moving up and down Okay, so, <clears throat> so what you're going to do, first you're going to have this ring, you get go up, then this is going to go in there, like that, just like this, you see, and this, I don't know if you can see it, but this will tighten up, it'll put pressure on there, so that it's, uh, firm all right so what i'm gonna go i'm gonna go inside put this two first and then in the while i'm underneath there once i'm ready to put enough pressure in there i'm gonna have my wife push down so that when i when she pushes down and i tighten it's gonna have a a, a, a firm, you know secured uh item there you know so let me make sure there's no other things in this in here there's not okay good every one of these faucets are different so you always want to make sure you don't want to do something and then all of a sudden you have three or four parts that you didn't think about so okay let's go ahead i'll tell you elizabeth whenever uh okay. when i'm ready this is going to be a little painful, but that's the way life is. No pain, no gain. Here, let me take my glasses off. Okay, no pain, no gain. Okay, make sure it's lined up, Elizabeth. Um, yeah, you, I think you you don't you don't have a choice. It, it, it yeah, lines up by itself. Yeah, I think it's, yeah it is. Okay, are you ready? Yeah. I'm okay, pressing. put a little pressure. Yeah. I'm ah. Pressing it. Okay. All right, now. All right, so this we don't need. Like I said, I don't want to put this in there yet, but we will have to put this in like this. Okay. This is going to go in there just like this and then there's going to be a little bit of pressure right there so i don't know if you can see it but there's a sponge in there it's a little bit bigger than this so when it pushes the pressure it seals right in here so water can go inside there so remember we have this to seal this part this is what's going to seal from water getting inside here. So 
this has to go first, then this. Okay, don't do what I did. Uh, that, uh, I will uh, have to put that. Okay, my wife was just showing me something. Oh no, that's gonna be, let me see. Okay, so look. <clears throat> This thing here, we gotta go in there. Stick this in here, like this. You see this other thing coming out right there, right? So you're gonna put this in there. See, sometimes it's good to have your wife, wife around because uh, they keep you in line. I almost put it together without doing this part. Okay, so this right here is eventually when I'm underneath there, I could do it right now. I want to snap that in there with this things here and this here. I'm going to mount it together. Okay, so um, give me a second and I'll, uh, I want to look at some instructions. Normally I don't, but I, I, I really need to look and, and see exactly how this little seals, how they go in here and here. So I, I need to figure out what this thing is. All right, so I'll find out what these things are for. <clears throat> I could go underneath there and do this, but I'm gonna go ahead and do it here for you, okay, for y'all. So watch, this is gonna, so there's two seals right here to keep water from coming out of here, right? So what you're gonna do, is you're gonna push this in all the way the tip will go all the way there like that this guy is gonna keep it together so that the pressure of the water does not make it come apart so all you do you go in here you're gonna hear it snap you see it snapped now if the pressure was too high it's not gonna pull it apart now what I'll have to do is I'll go in here Oh, you know what? Here, here, here. One thing you want to do before you do that. Okay. So you see, this comes out. One thing you want to do is, where's the round? No, that uh, ring. Oh, here. Okay. One thing you want to do is get this and put it in here like so. What this does, when it's underneath there, it keeps it like this, the weight of it, so that if this wasn't there, it might twist around. This is gonna uh, do this, but so you know what? We are gonna have to do it underneath there, but at least you got to see how I'm gonna do it, because you, you might it's gonna be hard to see underneath there, because I cannot stick this in there. So, we're going to take that out, but now you know what I'm going to do with this thing. It's going to go right in here. So, the next thing we're going to do, we're going to grab this, stick it in there, stick that in there. So, I don't know if you can see it. Here, let me bring it to you. Here, there's some notches here. Those notches, there's going to be some notches right in here. They're going to have to, you're going to have to move this thing around until that notch fits right in there. Okay, now you can see, once you do that, it looks good there right let's try this again go in here this in here those two in there remember you got a little uh rubber seal here that goes in first kind of be careful make sure that it's not 
twist it or anything. Now that feels good. Okay, now Elizabeth, what I need for you to do for me, I want you to hold that like this because when I'm underneath there, when I'm tightening everything up, this one I, want. I don't want this thing to be sideways. Uh -huh. It doesn't matter because we're gonna yeah. be able to do this, but I want it to look uniform straight. straight. Yeah. Okay. So make sure it's straight like this. Yeah. Try not to make make it look like that. Okay. Okay. So uh, you're gonna have to get down here because I've got to crawl underneath there. Yeah. All right. Yeah. So just hold it like that for me. Okay. So you have a coal and you got a hot water. Uh, make sure you put the hot water with the hot water. In their case, uh, they do have a red and a and a white, and and I do have a red red and a white pipe. So the red goes with the red, and the white goes with the white. So let me push this down so you can see what I'm doing down here. So you see this right here? What you want to do is get this level like this, and this like this. So whenever you put these two things in there, it'll put pressure on that, okay? So let's see, uh, looks like you got a notch here. There's probably a notch underneath there. So this is probably gonna fit right inside that notch. Okay, so let's... Oh, by the way, this underneath there, so I can see, okay, it's gonna screw clockwise. First, this goes up, and this is gonna go clockwise. Once we do that, we'll, we'll take care of all these other hoses. Let me see if my... Uh, let me see if I can get in there. All right, so let's go in here. Let me crawl in here again. Okay, so before I crawl in there, the first the first thing I want to do is put this ring in there first. Then this one goes in this way, if you can see it, okay? This is how we want it to go in. So now I'll put this in there and then try to crawl inside there. All three of them have to go inside, okay? There's hardly any room in here. And then there's another hose that you gotta get in between all this stuff. And, okay. Okay, push, Elizabeth. Push. Yeah, I'm pushing. Okay. Pushing down. Okay, move it around. Is, 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 is it tight? Uh, move everything. Not, not, not the top part. Okay, here, I'll, I'll check it. Okay, no, no. Yeah, uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get a screwdriver. I'm going to get this Phillips. And it has a screw that I can tighten it up. So this should tighten up a little bit. But I think that it's still going to be able to move. But I want it tight, secure. But I think it still gives me the option to move back and forth and to go up and down. So it's a nice little 
nice little thing. So for right now, we're gonna hold it right yeah. there so that it'll be secured in that position. Even though it moves, I still want it tightened. I don't wanna have to go back inside here again. So when, whenever you tighten in this, you don't want to tight too, too tight. It just has to be snug. Okay, how does it feel now, Elizabeth? Better, more secure. And can it move around? You, you hear it snapping right now? Yeah. It's secure. Oh, okay. So, uh, which is nice, because if you don't have to pull this out, you can move it around. This is a nice, you bought a nice one. Congratulations. You didn't go too cheap on me. Okay, good. Now, we're going to get these two things. First, I want to move this guy in here like this. No, that's, that's and uh, there's, inside there, I'm going to snap those two like I showed you earlier. But this thing here is not really, all this is going to do is just keep it down because I have something here that's not going to allow it to go all the way down. So let me go ahead and get underneath there and secure this. Hopefully I don't have to crawl too far inside. No, 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 that, that, that I can put there. Ouch. Okay, let me see if I can... Nope. Gotta do this with one hand. Ah, oh, good. Fit in there. Come on, snap in there. Come on, baby. You can do it. Ah, oh, perfect. Now, okay, they're secured. Now, <clears throat> we're almost done. So we got these two hoses here. Uh-oh. Houston, we got a slight problem. So you see these two two uh hoses? It's not the same. Now what I gotta do is convert this, and I'm gonna have to have some something that will convert those two together. So I'll have to go back to Home Depot. And so it looks like I'm gonna need two males. One of them looks like a, a one, a five sixteenths, and then this looks like a half inch. Uh, but I'll check it out when I go to Home Depot. So I don't know if y'all can see that, but that's not gonna fit. So, um, back to Home Depot. All right, guys, so I just went to Home Depot and I bought uh, two, three eighths, two and one half inch compressions, okay, fittings. They're both females, because I got two females that I need to uh, put together. So now I'm just gonna connect those two hoses. Now, in most cases, all you would do is put that to your cutoff valve. Okay, so a lot of them are 3 8 inch cutoff valves, but this is an RV, so we have to uh, adjust. Okay, so let's go ahead and do that. All right, so since they're compressions, I really don't need to put this tape for their compressions. So um, first, I'm going to go ahead and connect my red. So I'm going to connect this first female to the male then i'm gonna bring this guy over down here 
and connect my oops. make sure that that you don't strip nothing it's kind of i'm trying to uh, it's kind of hard to get in here Okay, so it doesn't take a lot of turning. Now I'm going to get my uh, my white and the uh, blue is going to be my cold water. So go in here, put that in there. Get this one, combine those two together. It's kind of tough to try to line them up. There we go. But you don't want to tighten them up too much because you know their compressions uh they're they're rubbers uh, this is what do you see it i'm just going to tighten the, with this other one All right, now we just gotta test it. All right, so I got the water on. There's no leaks. When I turn off the water, that's gonna put more pressure on the hoses. And no leak, no leak. Perfect, the job is done.